A terrifying scene at Tokyo's Haneda Airport. A Japan Airlines plane erupting into flames after it collided with a Japan Coast Guard aircraft on the runway. Prime Minister Fumio Kishido says all 379 on board the passenger plane, including eight children, are expected to be okay. They were evacuated before the plane was engulfed in flames. But at least five people on the second aircraft were killed, only the captain making it out alive. NHK reports that crew was preparing to fly to Nagata, Japan, for earthquake relief and route to deliver supplies to the affected region. The quake's death toll reaching at least 49, with dozens still trapped under rubble. Fire teams at Haneda worked feverishly to extinguish the flames that streaked across the runway. The plane completely disintegrated, but it is remarkable that not a single one of those passengers was hurt or killed in that collision. The JAL passenger flight was landing at Haneda from Hokkaido. Experts say the plane, an Airbus A350, is a total loss, but is a testament to how newer commercial planes are designed to ensure all on board can evacuate within 90 seconds. The incident, a rare one, with experts saying Japan Airlines holds an impeccable safety record. The airplane did its job here. What we think what happened is that this was a pilot error. Somebody, probably on the Japanese Coast Guard side, uh, taxied onto that active runway uh, when they weren't supposed to. Now, Japanese safety officials will start a lengthy investigation into what caused the collision. The condition of the surviving captain of that Coast Guard plane remains unclear. M. Wynn, ABC News, Washington.